Alright guys, this is our finished house. As you can see, I just continued on the uh, stairs for the roof and made the exact same on the other side. With one difference, there's no door, it's just glass. So this will be the back of your house. So what I'm going to do now, since this was quite a short video, it only took me like 30 minutes or so to build this house. I'm going to build a little garden. It's not really for the tutorial, I just want to see what it's going to look like with the the roads and things. So if you're just building this house and you don't want to build the garden, it's not going to be a back garden, it's going to be a front garden here and a side garden really with a swimming pool and stuff. If you don't want to build that then this will just be the end of the video, and I'll see you in the next video. But if not, then let's continue on building. So what I'm going to do is just build a wall going right around the house. And I'm just going to build a little garden with a path and some trees and stuff. And then I'll add in a swimming pool and more trees. It's not going to be anything exciting, I just want to see what it's going to look like. Because I've not built any houses with my new road design, so I'm going to see what that looks like. Hopefully it looks quite good. I really like it the way it is just now, it's quite wide and uh, lots of space, and I, I really like it so far. Alright, I think I will just get a light grey wool and build a simple wall going all the way around. It's going to be from here right up to the edge of this path, since that's why it's there. Um, I think I will make uh, a gate somewhere. I'll decide in a second. I'm just going to make this go all the way around the the house to start with, just up to there. And yeah, like that. And then we're going to build. I think I will add like some kind of water feature into this garden, so I'm gonna get oak leaves. Leave a space of three in there. Oh, one, two, three, like this. Yeah, that looks quite good. Let's see, one, two. Hopefully that's the same size. So I missed one, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah. I'm gonna build a, a winding path. So we'll start here. And I'm just going to start winding it around. Make sure it's mostly three wide. I think when you build a path, it's best to uh, not put too much thought into it. Unless it's a straight path, obviously, but it looks better if you just kind of sporadically build it. It looks more natural, anyway. So I'm just going to try to get this to the front door. somehow. And uh, there we go. Um, I'll fill in with gravel. Um, yeah, that looks good. A sporadic winding path. Make sure that it's wide enough to walk on. So if you can't build a sporadic winding path, you can, uh, just try your best. <laughs> Just fill all this in with gravel. And then I'm going to connect this path to the back garden, or the side garden. 
and then I'll fill in all of this grass here with water. So the only part you can walk on in the garden is just this path. But first of all, I will go to sleep. Yeah, I'm liking this already. Alright, I'll go to sleep so we can see. I'm not going to show you the entire build, I'll just uh, speed up some because I'm going to fill in this whole back garden probably. Dig it out and fill it in, there's no point in watching it. So I will plant a tree. A spruce wood tree. Right in the middle here, somewhere. Hopefully it doesn't overtake my path. Right there. Ah, uh, perfect. And then I will dig a little bit around it so it looks like an island. Mm, like that. And then I'm going to dig out all of this. Everything that's not the path or this little island of tree here. I'm going to dig it all out. And when you get to the window of your copying this, then don't get rid of the glowstone. You can just stay there. That looks pretty good. I tend not to put too much time into making a garden because um, I have so many houses that I like them all to be different, you know. So they all have the same basic things in them, but I like to just uh, make them all as different as I can. Alright, we'll just dig out of this side as well. Make sure we keep the glowstone. I will probably get rid of this three bits here and try and attach the path on. So there's a, a way into the back garden because I don't want there to be a back door really for this house. I want the uh, this to be the only door. So we need a way to the over here to the swimming pool and stuff. Dick, oh, I could I should just be using a speed potion. Potion of swiftness. This will go so much faster. There we go. And let's try to touch this one on. Um, I'm not really going to decorate inside this house. I have to rebuild all of these houses one day in my city. And I don't really want to spend time decorating them, really. Because I'll have to redecorate them one day. So I should, might as well just wait until then. Uh, uh, this is much harder doing it this way. <laughs> I have no idea what this looks like. And that is terrible. So let's say three. Um, you know what, I'll stick with it. I'm gonna add in grass and stuff on this little island. And I'm going to fill in all this with water. I'm gonna get some torches. And the whole point of these things here, this is where the water is going to come from, so I'm going to just put a little back on there and make this kind of loop over like that. And then the water will look like it's going to come from here, so like that. I'm not too sure I like this, but Maybe I'll make it a different color, actually. Let's see. Grey. Or maybe, actually, I can make it spruce wood plank. 
so it matches the house. Better fill that in quick. Yeah, I can ma make that over the top like that. So it matches our house. Yeah, that looks good. I could do the same over here. And we can place our one there. And obviously we can place our torches on either side of it. And now we can just fill this in with water. So this is our front garden. Mm, fill this in as well. Oops. Uh, keep placing blocks all over the place. And let's see what this looks like. Um. Oh, I forgot to dig out this. Um, perfect. I think it looks pretty cool. So we have our path. You come in this way. There's only one way to get to the house through the path. And we can add in some lily pads, I guess. Wherever they may be. Oh, they're there. One there, one there, one there. Just place them randomly. One in here. And that's our front garden finished. I will probably add in glass pane around the top of this. So you can't jump in that easily, since it's supposed to be someone's garden. And I will continue this wall right to the end of here. And add in a swimming pool. So I'm just going to bring this right along. to the edge of this path. And all the way up, I'm not going to leave any space on the, uh, behind the house. I will just make, like, a wall that goes one past, like that. And then on this side will probably be another road. And I'll just bring this all the way along. here, like that. And again, this here will probably be path and road as well. So all I'm going to do is quickly build out a shape for a swimming pool. Like this. Maybe not like that. Two three, four, it's going to be a rather big swimming pool.
Perfect. I'm just going to uh, quickly fill this in and it'll be speeded up. I'm going to dig out all of this and I'm going to add in some trees so I will see you in a minute when it's all done. Alright guys, that's our finished house. I dug out the swimming pool, which you saw, just randomly, didn't matter what it looked like. Placed in some stone bricks and glowstone, filled it in. I was going to put in decking, but I decided just to place loads of trees randomly around. And because I've been recording for like six hours straight now, obviously not this one video, but lots of different videos, so it didn't really matter about what it looked like. I just want to uh, go find the biggest cup of coffee I could find and stop recording. So guys, if you like the video and the tutorial, don't forget to subscribe and like to get my next videos and keep up to date with them and things. And comment as well, because um, I want suggestions for other videos and tutorials and things that Especially things that people are struggling to build, because I'll attempt to build anything. And um, I'll see you in my next video.